Fireplace ashes. Red and tears for this. I said they're cop right there. I know me too. I was like, are we getting arrested? I was like, let me look again. Good morning vlog. Happy Sunday. So as you guys remember, probably in last week's video, I dropped Paige off at the airport around like 3.30 in the morning. And then I came back here and I just snoozed the morning away. Like it's currently noon. <laughs> Fail. But anyway, I have some homework that I need to get done before I go to work. So my plan is literally just to sit here and write a paper. Really fun and exciting, I know. So that's all that's going on. It's gonna be a pretty chill Sunday. Can already predict that one. But uh, yeah, so have about two hours until I need to start getting ready for work. So hopefully I can finish this paper. Hey you guys, all right, so it's a little bit later. Finished my paper, it actually went way better than I was expecting it to. I always like work up papers in my mind and I'm like, oh my God, this is gonna take me like 50 hours. And it literally took me like a minute, so it was fine. Um, so I just went to Sugar House Coffee before work because I am violently out of groceries since Paige was in town and we ate out a lot. So I didn't think to buy any groceries for the week. So I need to do that tomorrow, but for now i got sugar house coffee so i got my golden graham chai no spro of course and then in here it's a turkey pesto sandwich although i forgot to say no tomato so we're gonna have to be brave today and eat the tomato and or take it out probably just take it out oh wow look at how good they made this though are you kidding i have about 25 minutes until i have to be at work so i'm gonna sit here scarf this down and then head to the news so see you guys later <laughs> Hey you guys, we are at a Maverick right now, of course, getting gas. And I just went to Target because my mom sent me a little Halloween package that I had to pick up. So I have the bags right here. So once I'm done getting gas, we'll do a little unboxing haul. So that's kind of fun. I'm excited. Also, this Maverick is like popping off right now. Like my plan was just to sit here and like show you guys what I got, but there's so many people around that I'm like, okay, I don't know. I don't know if it's the move. There's like literally like, I am looking at a group of eight people standing next to me getting gas. Like, what is happening here? Why is it social hour at Maverick? All right, we got to a more chill location because that Maverick was chaos. So we're at our next stop of the day, but we'll get to that in a second. First, let's open our little goodies we have. We got a lemur face mask. <laughs> That's fun. Next up, we got a little t-shirt moment. It's giving spooky Halloween vibes. It's all the Disney villains on a little shirt. So that's kind of cool. Ah, uh, yes. We, of course, got some Reese's and some candy corn. I love candy corn, and all the haters can sit down. Candy corn's amazing. And last but not least, we got this little Squishmallow thingy. Let's open it. Oh, who is this little geezer? No idea. There he is. Anyway, right now we are at Alpha Coffee, which is a coffee shop that's by like Big Cottonwood Canyon. It has a very pretty view from what I remember the last time. I actually went here last year with Paige and I remember the chai wasn't great, but the vibes inside the coffee shop were amazing. And I have a lot of homework to get done today. So I thought we would just hang out at this coffee shop for about two hours until I have to head to work. So let's grab our things and head on in there. So I didn't vlog much today, so I'm sorry for that because honestly, like once I got to the coffee shop, I just was like, I need to do my homework right now. So I got my chai and I added pumpkin to it and it was so good. I rated it a 7.35 out of 10 on my chai rankings that I have going. Oh, finger puppet, okay. Oh my gosh, is that a dog in my room? So that was pretty good. And I was just working on my screenplay that I'm currently writing for my class. So fun, I know. So I did that until about one 45 ish and then i was like oh shoot i have to drive to work and since i was all the way out at big Cottonwood canyon it was a whole thing to get to work it didn't take me that long i wasn't late for work or anything but still took a little bit so i got to work did my job during my lunch break i went and got a poke bowl which was really exciting haven't gotten one of those in a while and there's actually a really good place here for those even though it's like a landlocked state so shout out to utah for having decent sushi and keeping me alive all these years <laughs> Halloween! Happy Halloween, everyone. I'm not dressed festive at all. I guess I'm going as, um, I'm wearing pink, so I'm, uh, Dutch Bros Barbie! Okay, anyway, so I was gonna wake up at 7 in the morning, or 6.30, and go to a spin class, and that was a choice. But my alarm goes off at 6.30 and I'm like, you know what, hold on a second, let me make sure I have class today because it's Halloween. So I checked my email and I did have an email from my teacher and I was like, oh wow, okay. And I opened the email 
were sharing my script in class. I was like, uh, excuse me. Normally how this has worked is that the class before people volunteer to share their script the next class. I didn't get that luxury. Instead, I got an email saying, Allie, you're presenting today. So then I ended up not going to my spin class because I was panicked because I was like, I didn't know I'd be sharing my script today. So I had to just like edit and redo some of my script. I still only had half of it. Um, so Professor really, oh, I probably shouldn't say his name. I love this guy though, so no, no hate to him. So then I ended up going to my class, didn't make it to spin class, because once again, I was panicking. So once I got to my class, everything was fine and dandy. We shared my script, it went well. Now I got my pumpkin caramel brulee ice chai to celebrate. Do I have napkins in here? Yay. Jersey Mike's napkins, of course. Anyway, um, so it's my day off today, so. I honestly have zero plans. I woke up this morning feeling a little bit um. sus, to be honest. Maybe it was just because I got up so early. I don't know. But I was just like not feeling 100%. So I think I'm going to keep it that way. Going to have a chill day today. I need to run some errands. And first on our list is to go to Big O Tires. So exciting. I know. Because I have low tire pressure. And I know I could just go to a gas station. But I've been to like three gas stations in Utah and all of the like air pumps have been out of service. So we're just going to go to the big dogs instead and have them do it for me. I didn't vlog it because it just didn't need to be, but I survived the tire pressure check or whatever the heck. And now my tires are ready to go. But the person was like, you need new tires, which I feel like that was just because they work at a tire shop. They're like, you should get new tires because then I asked, I was like, oh, when should I get new tires? And they're like, sometime like what like in my life of course i'm gonna get new tires on this car are you saying in this moment in time if i keep driving on these tires i'm gonna explode or are you saying hey at some point over the next 50 years you should get new tires like i'm confused so i just was like uh, okay I'll, I'll talk to my dad because i'm not a car girl i have many things in this world but i am not a car girl so i i have no idea i parked next to my car twin this will be the last car vlog, I promise, but I was in there and my interest was definitely piqued by some of their seasonal stuff. Specifically, stuffing flavored kettle chips. So I thought we would try them. <coughs> Maybe they're not to eat. Maybe they're just to look at. What the heck? Um, so I'm not a big Thanksgiving food person, but these just sounded interesting to me. And I, I, I vibe with stuffing. I like it occasionally. So let's see. Let's see what this is like. Here's what the chip looks like. Theoretically, it's not bad. But there is a hint of, like, meat, which I could do without. Hey, you guys, we are out on the town right now. Lover. Yeah, I'm in my lover era. <laughs> And Ethan's in his Taylor Swift tour era. And we are going to go see the Eras movie. Ah! So exciting. So fun fact, Ethan actually went to this same concert. I went to the SoFi concert in LA and this is the one it was filmed at. So I might be in it. So fingers crossed Ethan's in it. But we're going to grab Costa Vida. We really wanted something else, but it's not going to work out. So we're getting that and then we'll be in the theater. Wow, it's dripping. Look at <laughs> Good. I got tacos as well. They're playing big time Russian here, so Costa Vida vibe is actually pretty good. We made it into the theater, you guys. guys. guys oh yeah, the new Hunger Games movie, I'll be all over that when it comes Pretty out. Cool. But yeah, we made it in, we're walking into the theater. We're so early. <laughs> yeah. What's up, bud? Does anyone here know the lyrics to this bridge? I do, I do. We're in the fearless but era right now. Real, don't be afraid. Make it out of this mess. It's a love story. Baby, just say yes. It's like I'm sitting right next to Taylor. Evermore. I don't know any of the songs in this, so now I'm just kind of vibing here. We're in the reputation era right now. Hey guys, she's getting her reputation back soon. <laughs> she needs it back. Don't you let it go. It's speak now if it was unclear from that. I was enchanted to be you. Is it really your favorite song? No. Okay. You guys, we're 
in my favorite era, red. Folklore. I don't know any of these ones either. <laughs> Awkward. When's August? Hopefully soon. Maybe it's the last one. Okay. Update, the next song was August, so we're here now. 1989. <laughs> it's midnight now. Nice. Hey guys, we made it out from the Eras tour. Yeah. Only a three hour movie going experience. <laughs> Guys, my voice hurts, not gonna lie. Hey, yeah, Ethan basically carried that for the entire theater. movie theater. Like, I don't even know if anyone else was singing, but I know the man Guys. next to me was, and that man was Ethan, not the other guy, so. My, vote, my voice hurts. I honestly didn't think I didn't sing for like two or three of the songs. Like, my voice hurts. It was great. I really enjoyed it. I mean, I'm not a huge Swifty, but I feel like I'm, I'm getting there. It was, it was really hype. It was actually a really great, like, for like a movie, it was, or like, you know what I mean? It was very good. Yeah, I was, I was captivated the whole time. Yeah. I would rate the overall experience, like, totally like a 9 out of 10. Yeah, it was like, awesome. I don't know why it's not 10, but it, it's 9 out of 10. Well, maybe because we weren't, like, actually at the concert. Yeah, my, when and I was there, it was 10 because they didn't play out, out of the woods or Getaway Car or Hits Different. Great experience, great time, and is now currently at 11 o'clock. We have one minute left of Halloween, so we're going to go trick-or-treating! <laughs> We have an hour and one minute. Did I say one minute? Yes. <laughs> it's bedtime. It's basically Christmas time now. I've decided because I just want Dutch Bros and the Christmas menu is out. So basically Christmas. But I'm here at Dutch Bros. It's sticker day today because it's the first Wednesday of the month. I'm jazzed about it. Um, I'm all dressed up because I just went to church because it's All Saints Day. So it's a holy day of obligation for us Catholics. So I had to boogie over to church this morning. So I did that. Now I'm getting a chai and life is so good. Like I am just so ready for Christmas time. I have my Christmas playlist playing. Kind of ironically, but also just because I was like, oh. Christmas music. I love it. First things first, the sticker is adorable. I am absolutely obsessed with this. And um, now let's try the chai. So I got, of course, a Christmas morning iced chai. I've actually never tried this chai before. I normally go for their like candy cane drink selection during this time of the year, but I thought I'd never tried the Christmas chai, so I might as well try it today. I think it's just a white chocolate chai, so let's see. Mm. That's really good. And the cup says, rubble without a clause. <laughs> I think it's funny. Late in the day and we're at the mall. Best believe I'm still bejeweled. <laughs> Just kidding, we're at the errors tour again. <laughs> but the mall, Ethan, what are we here for? I literally thought that said sushi, steak, and shakes. I really thought, I'm like, whoa. He's a teacher, so he needs some sweaters, was what he just said. Yeah, and this like, this sweater's like fine, but it's just like. He said he's looking for a cow print one. <laughs> Kind of cute. We'll update you guys on if we find that. <laughs> we finished our shopping trip and now Ethan's currently entering to win a, what is his and her cool? scooter. Ethan, what did you order? I got Love on the Beach. And I got Treasure Mountain. It's so fancy looking. We're at Wasatch Brewery, by the way. I just spilled it. That was probably like $10 that I just spilled on the ground. How was it? Bomb. It's pretty good. <laughs> it's chai time. It's always chai time. Literally, if these videos are anything, it's just me getting a nice chai every day. So I guess when I'm old and looking back on my senior year, I'll just be like, well, at least you got a chai every day. I wonder if I'll still like chais when I'm old. I'm sure I will. I got the chai. It's really good. Also, oh, you can't see it. Oh, there it is. Sinclair Dinosaur. I'm not getting gas, but I just love him. He's amazing. I think once I graduate, the thing I'll miss most about Utah is Sinclair's, probably. Hey, you guys. Happy Friday. It's currently my lunch break. Completely forgot to vlog this morning. All I did was just like homework and hang out at home, so you didn't really miss anything. But we're going to head home for the lunch break. Let's see if Ethan's there. Let's see what's going on. Happy Friday. Except it's my Tuesday, but we don't need to talk about it. Guys, it's finally Friday, and I actually have a real Friday, so I'm like, yay, go Friday, yay! 
Yay! So. <laughs> I'm really bejeweled tonight, like I'm excited. Uh, do you have anything exciting to share? I've had a boring day, so they've gotten they've gotten nothing today. Did I have an exciting day? Um No. Like Oh, oh, I drove all the way to Panera and which is far if you know if you know. Yeah. And I I got my drink, I spilled it all over my table. <laughs> There was someone like sitting next to me, so got on their shoe. I was mortified. I was like, I'm so sorry. I should have put a lid on it. And he goes like this. Doesn't say a word. I was oh, so wow. scared. Oh wow. Anyway, lunch break slash eat the. Oh. <laughs> I just fell all over my face. Okay, I'm cooking. Can you guess what I'm cooking? Probably butter chicken. Always. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, microwaving. There it is. Spinning round and round. Hey vlog. Hey vlog. Happy Saturday. We are in downtown. Me and Ethan are really having a bro moment right now. We're at a pub and we're pub brewery. We're at Red Rock Brewery and we're watching the game. No Utes. Yes. Who are we playing? We're playing ASU. Who do you want to win? Obviously the Utes. Good, good answer, good answer. Yeah. What did you get to drink? I got a margarita. Oh. Okay. There's a weird name to it, but I couldn't tell you what it is. Yeah, we both got festive Thanksgiving drinks, so this is I'm Thank Mule. You're laughing, I bet. It's like I'm thankful. Um, but yeah, Thanks so guys, guys, I was so worried about what to order, so I gotta like, half chicken. <laughs> we will be vlogging when that comes out. <laughs> the half chicken. Guys, it's crazy. I got a cop. Is that a half? Channeling my mom. Is that a half? Shout out to you, mom. Score of the game is zero zero, by the way. We'll keep you updated. Okay. We finished our Red Rock meal. The Utes are winning 14 zeros. So I never actually circled back to what happened with the ASU and Utah football game, but clearly they won. It was 55 to three, which fun fact is Utah specifically is biggest margin of victory ever in a Pac-12 game. So that's really exciting. And now I kind of jump around and jump super late into the day. So basically I'm just telling you guys that I am redoing my bookshelf. So that's what's happening next. All right, here's the current state of the Halloween shelf. Let's get it all November looking now. And this is where it's at now. I obviously haven't gotten my like Christmas books yet. So I went with more of just like a blue and kind of snowy theme for it. And then I feel like this Miko Munchling is kind of giving Thanksgiving. So we'll have him sitting out until it's December and then we'll get out some Christmas books for the shelf. But I think it looks good for now. Anyway, I have some time before I go to work. So I'm just gonna hang out, probably get ready for work cause I'm not gonna go in this and do my hair cause my bangs are looking a little bit confusing right now. So I have some time. So I'm just gonna hang out for a little while, probably watch some friends. It's been what I've been binging recently. So that is my plan. I don't go to work until 7.15 today. So it's been a very chill, very nice day to not have to be at work at 2.45 like normal. So big shout out for the five o'clock newscast for not happening today. <laughs> Ethan. What's going on? I'm, Just um, eating some bread. Eating some bread. I'm in my blankie and I'm about to cook a dinner for a very special person. <laughs> <laughs> Ali, what are you doing tonight? I'm going out tonight. Best believe I'm still bejeweled. bejeweled. No, I'm not going out tonight. I'm going to work tonight. Um, but yeah, I don't know if this has been that exciting of a week, but you know what? Weeks are like that sometimes. Yeah. Yeah, you have, we're riding the highs and lows of senior year. This week was a little bit of just a, just a week, it happened. Well, thank you guys so much for watching this week's video. Hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to comment down below your favorite part of the video. There you go, yeah. And Is that what you want me to say? Sure. Oh, you can oh, also like and subscribe. <laughs> but yeah, with that being said, thanks so much for watching. And as always, go Utes!